Hello everyone, and welcome back to another video. And today, welcome to anywhere. Cause when you when you have no social skills and you need to branch out of your home, this is the perfect way to do it. With welcome to anywhere. So, anyways, it's available in Spanish if you were wondering. And also, let's just get right into it. All right, let's start a new game. Ready to get started with Digital Compass? First, create a new username. So, the other one you can use up. Okay. Alright. Hmm. Welcome to anywhere. Ugh. These kids may not look like you and me, no. but trust me, their days are just like ours. Jam packed fly. from sunup to sundown. Shut with up. friends, school, family, and other commitments. Shut up. Oh, Shut and up. of course. There's some drama, too. Are you serious? Explore their worlds by taking Shut a walk up. in their shoes. Shut up! And anywhere, it's up to you to help them make Shut some real-world decisions in their daily lives. Some big, Stop. some small. The choices you make will determine their fate. And Who do we start with? Let's start with the most embarrassing one. What was this one's? Yeah, this is definitely the most embarrassing. All right, let's see. What's going on? Can't believe summer is almost here. Time to finally look for that internship you've been talking about for weeks. You hope there's still something worthwhile on the career board. Awesome ad LLC. Photo changer and design it up. Should you post too? No. Not sure you uh, want the world to see, but you could use some support too. Yeah, no. Isn't this like about being smart? Like, unless you want to get bashed by the cruelty that is the internet, I would suggest not posting. So step one, you have to fill out a jobs application. Really? See, you're moving and shaking already. Hmm. Why does this online application have a user agreement? Fiddlesticks. This thing is long and time's a wasting. You know they're like all the same. Okay. Who is actually, who, all right. Let, let's be for real for who actually reads the user agreement? If you read the user agreement, you are not the, like the rest of us humans. You are an alienated species like no other. Since when has there been an option to autofill for work samples? Whoa, information overload. This is all really important if you want this internship. Social but, security? But do you really have to share all that information for the online world to see? Social security number, of course you do. address, uh -huh. date of birth, uh -huh. email address, uh -huh. <sighs> but there's no time. It's either be smart or find a shortcut. This is not giving me an option to put in my social security number and have a SWAT team come to my house. So I'm going to have to go with be smart, I guess. You kind of knew that. Fiddlesticks. Stop the double saying dare fiddlesticks. Again. You could try to explain the childish dare. They might think it's funny. Or you could just deny, deny. You fess up to the double dog dare. Awesome Ads admires your honesty. Encouraged, you pitch a random idea to them. Paisan's pizza is so delicious, you'll take it anywhere. I double dog dare you. Where will you take it next? Hashtag double dog dare becomes an instant huge hit as kids from all over the country share serious? branches of themselves taking on the challenge. You are rewarded not only with the internship, but with a lifetime supply of Paisan's Pizza. Let's go! <sighs> Let's play that game. This music makes me want to unlive my... Who should we do next? Yeah, so let's do that one. Insta slam. Are you serious? <sighs> Enough already. It's barely Same 8 o'clock, people. Cute? Brute? You don't get what this is all about and don't have time to figure it out. You're going to be late for math class and Mrs. Bunch loves to calculate tardies. Jeez, what is up with everyone? What are they talking about and why is it so funny? Mrs. Bunch is finding no humor in this. Okay, let's see what all the fuss is about. Rate your peers based on their looks? Are they cute, 
or brute. Oh, I know which one I am. This is not interested. You are being bombarded now. Why aren't you playing? Just play, it's harmless. You are missing out. Okay, the pressure is kind of getting to you. Look at everybody. Even Look Breaker at everybody is bombarding using their you. phones. He likes it, and everyone else seems to love it. So how bad can it really be? Well, if we're being completely honest, nothing good comes from the internet, so... No. You, Pepper, are above all of this nonsense. You do yeah. not care to buy silly apps based on silly ideas. Yeah. You are here to learn. Yeah. Exactly. You just made the top five cute list. The top cute list. Oh my God! Okay, you'll admit Chester that now the Cheetah is on the top five. You're, you're oh sure no, Miss Jolly Rancher is sad. You knew your mom would react this way to the app. A woman is known by the company she keeps. Okay. Not sure how that's helping. There's pressure from company you keep. Like every minute type of pressure. I have said three times, this being the fourth, I don't want to use the app. You never knew you had so much time on your hands. And speaking of free hands, what? you end up what? keeping your paws busy by crocheting what is that that hat? Become all the rage. Talk about cute. You Those are not cute. Friends, who also ditch cute and brute to devote time to helping you with your new entrepreneurial venture. You donate 10% of your profits to your school to fund a kindness campaign. Unwired Magazine hears the story and features you on its cover. Knit one, Pearl two. Wow. Let's do Miss Jolly Rancher next. Periwinkle's texting. It's again. the same voice again! Everyone says you're a chatterbox and born to be on face knock. Sure, you like to talk, but with your mouth, so that people can hear you with their ears. Between texts and term papers, who has the time for more typing? Plus, you need your hands free because everyone knows that texting and skating don't mix. Okay, okay. Enough with the peer pressure. Wow, Periwinkle sure is popular. OMG, check out this super long privacy policy. Ugh. As we know from experience, who actually reads these? You're in. Hi, Wink. Look who's now on Face Knock. Like you said. Face Knock. No big load. Hungry? Want to win a lifetime supply of waffles? Yes. You do love waffles. But do you need to download the app? Maybe you should check it out more before just clicking the button. Uh, no. I want my waffles now. The app downloads, and you're asked to create a new account. No time. Can it see that you're busy being hungry? Hmm. Maybe it can see that you're starving. Scrolling across the screen are plates full of waffles. And what do you know? You love waffles. Or really? You could just use social sign in and log in through Face Knock. Uh. You have to enter your full name, your phone number, your home address, your school address, and even your grandparents' emails. Why do you have oh, to? There's more. Your daily schedule has to be entered as well? Yes. Kind of weird. One more step. Sure, why not? Enter your credit card information. Wait. Why? For free waffles? For one the waffles. One last step to complete your profile. I want the waffles. One more thing to verify your identity. What? Your social security number? Yes. Take anything. I want my waffles. Bad move. Since you failed to notice every single warning and prompt to protect your privacy, you find your online persona slowly is taken over by an imposter. Your online life is creeping into your offline life. You now have a real life doppelganger that looks and acts just like you. Okay. Your skateboards, your clothes, your expressions. Well, sort of. You report her to the authorities, who show up and cart you off as your doppelganger chats up all your friends. They have no idea that the fake you isn't you, oh. and that you aren't well, the fake you. Well, I just you. got arrested you for wanting free waffles. As you're loaded into a car and whisked away. I just wanted my waffles, man. I don't know what is wrong with the waffles. 
I'm I'm mad. I want my waffles. I didn't get my waffles. And now I'm in jail. Let's play the game anyway. I'm mad. Let's go! I think that's enough of anywhere. I think... I don't think my social level can take any more of this. So, uh... Maybe I'll do a part two. I have no idea. But this has been Common Sense Anywhere. <sighs> now I gotta get a therapist.